Hello, we're Financial Growth Solutions, Proactive Accountants for Finance Director Support. My name's Angela. What I'm going to do is talk you through how to set up an automatic bank feed for Xero, of which we're a bronze partner. OK, first thing you need to do is get into Xero. I'm already logged into Xero, and as you can see, I'm on Demo Company. I'm on Bank Accounts. If I go back to the dashboard, you'll see how I got to that, just in a second. OK, there's Demo Company. There's Bank Accounts. And all I do is I go to Banking. So I select Go to Banking. Once I'm in Go to Banking, I then need to add a bank account because I'm setting up an automated bank feed. I've got Bank Account, Credit Card, PayPal, select Bank Account. OK, now I can type in my bank name here. So for example, if I'm with NatWest, it comes up here, NatWest Bank UK. Bank feeds are available here, so it's giving me a tick. Account name. I can type in financial growth here. And then currency, CBP, British Pound. can leave that as it is. It's a British company. Put in my sort code here. So six digits for your sort code. And then for your account number, it should be eight digits. Then I select save once I've filled in all those fields. Okay, it takes me through and it's now saying financial growth has been added. Okay, if I scroll down here, you'll see I've got mine my own business, or my own my own business, and I've got financial growth. Okay, I can now edit that if I choose by going into here, edit account details, and if there's something I made a mistake on, I can change it there. And I can also set up automated processes. If I select the bank feed there, I can reconcile, import my bank accounts, and manage my accounts. Okay? I can use bank rules as well under Manage Account, where I can actually create a rule for receiving and spending money. And I'll just show you what I mean. If I click on Receive Money Rules, so obviously these are the people paying me, I can click on here to add one. And when money received on a bank account matches any conditions, any or all, and then you set a condition. So you can add a description and it'll automate the feed for you. Okay, hopefully you found